Hey everyone, so I'm going to show off the Samsung Anti-Accident Index here using the Samsung Galaxy Watch 8 Classic. So on your Samsung Health app, let's scroll all the way down, at least for me, it is the second to last thing right above the vascular load, which in a couple of days I'll make a video on that as well once you get two more nights of sleep with this watch on. But we have the Anti-Accident anti Index right here. Uh, when I did it this morning, as you can see, it was 6.54 a.m. Before I ate anything and whatnot, I was at a 65, uh, which is in uh, the kind of the middle of the low range there. And I, it does tell you things you can do to increase it as well. But we'll go ahead and do this. But before you do this, it will ask you to accept a few different things, which I, of course, already did. We'll hit measure and tell you how to do it. So you will press your thumb onto the or your thumb pad onto the back of it like this, and then hold it there for a few moments. So let's go ahead and do that. And I'm going to be quiet while I do that. So we'll go ahead and do it. Only takes a few seconds. Mine went up by seven points since six, almost seven o'clock this morning here. And you can see it goes it on here as well. You can also hit measure there as well. How to measure, show on phone, which it's already doing. Now let's go ahead and do this one more time just to see if it does change here. Okay. All right, so now it went up a little bit more again. Uh, so it might change a little bit every single time you do this. So I am now in the adequate adequate uh, range, barely. So when you can see one for 65 this morning at almost seven o'clock, it is now almost 3.30. Uh, then we did the first time, we did the same time. So it's gonna change a little bit every now and then. But now what I wanna say is from what I read online, from what people were saying on Reddit at least, is it seems like there are certain antioxidants that this will pick up more than others. Apparently, if you eat like the yellow and green, uh, yellow and orange foods, uh, like carrots and uh, stuff like that, apparently you will actually get a better score than if you are eating other types of antioxidant foods. Uh, so something, again, some that Reddit said, uh, which apparently there's been some uh, people testing it, and that is seems to be true. So it depends on the type of food you eat, you might get a higher or a lower score. But if you get a very, very low score, you probably do want to get a bit more antioxidant foods in you. Uh, yeah, you guys let me know what you think though. I think this is interesting. And and again, it does tell you some other stuff here as well. If you do want to read into it more. But you can see this other stuff that will affect you. But yeah, you guys let me know what you think. Thank you all for watching. Hope you have a good one. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.